Hello to all of you, Theodore Ziras, guitarcourses.org, and another lesson for you. Today, I want to talk about something really cool. I'm going to expand our technique and our phrasing vocabulary. I will talk about thirds, and I will show you a cool lick played in thirds uh, by using a specific scale, a specific scale, and I will make it sound interesting and cool. So, let's go straight to the lick. The tempo is 120, four notes per beat. It's a uh, okay tempo not too fast not too slow it is challenging for the majority of you so let's start and then i will explain what i did and how i did it let's go So this was the lick. Do you like it? I hope yes. So let me explain what I did. First of all, the theoretical part, what scale I'm using. I'm using a E Phrygian. And I did it on purpose. No subs, no flats. Natural notes. E, F, G, A, B, C, D. And back. So I'm doing this thing. Then the same thing from F. No subs, no flats. We can call it also F Lydian if we want, and then from D. And what I'm doing? I'm not playing the scale 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I'm playing in thirds. So, what it means that I'm starting from a root, let's say I'm in E, and I'm playing in Phrygian, and I'm playing first note E. Then, instead of playing the second, I will play the third. So, that's what we call, we call a third intervals so I have a one three two four three five four six etc and then back the same thing descending so this is the main idea one three two four etc so it's thirds and now I'll do it really really slow for you I put the tempo in 60 and I play for us per bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. F. So this is the lick, it sounds cool, it will remind you many many things. So this is the main idea, you can apply it of course in any scale you like, any chord progression you like, it doesn't really matter, all that matters is to master the scale you're gonna use, I mean about the fingerings, and then use them in a specific way to play that one, three, two, four, three, five, the third thing. So I will play it one more time, now I'll put the tempo a little bit faster, and make it sound a little bit more challenging. So it's 140, four notes per bit, let's go. One, two, three, go. So it was the exercise, it sounds cool, but in, you must practice hard in order to make it sound fluent and make it sound cool and in order to uh, be able to use it in your uh, phrasing, in your solo vocabulary, so you can play any melodic thing you like and then you can add some thirds, ascending, descending and spice up your soloing. So that was the main idea. It was guitarcourse.org and Theodore Ziras. If you like the video, thumbs up or down. And also, you can 
join my Patreon page, the link is here, uh, in which I'm uploading every week, cool stuff for you, and of course I have everything about this video, tab, guitar profile, backing track, and also you can support my channel. Thank you very, very much, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.